video we'll be doing the unboxing and have a first look at this moto g4 uh, the plus variant and uh, this is going to be sold in india via uh, what do you say amazon and here as you can see it gives us a brief idea about the specs it says that it has a 5.5 inch screen actually it's having a snapdragon 617 uh, chipset and uh, they have really improved the camera this time uh, it also has a laser auto focusing system and finally we get a fingerprint uh, sensor as you can see on the box so let's uh, quickly open this up and have a look so this is uh, the device itself and i have to say uh, for a 5.5 inch device it feels really light and uh, it says that it has turbo power uh, the what do you say that means it is having fast charging let's see if it has a fast charger in the box so let's keep this thing to the side and again it's a dual sim device as you can see and uh, here it gives us a brief idea that it is actually having a micro sim card and you're not supposed to use nano sim cards with adapters on this one this comes out let's keep this thing to the side and yes uh, this is the turbo power adapter uh, that means uh, fast charging is enabled on this one and uh, this is that beefy charger that we have seen uh, with uh, the Motorola devices also so it's nice that uh, this is included so you don't have to separately buy a fast charger let me keep those things to the side and we also get a headset so this is the device itself and this is the protective cover again I simply can't believe that uh, it feels actually really uh, light guys uh, for a 5.5 inch uh, device and uh, this is the indent to open the back cover but before that let me actually give you a physical overview we have the 3.5 mm headphone jack over here and uh, looks like uh, this rim is again metallic we have the power on off button and the volume rocker on the bottom we just have one slot that is the uh, micro usb slot that'll be used for charging this device and on this end nothing let's try to open up this back cover now and again this opens comes out and uh, looks like uh, uh, the battery uh, this is the battery but it's I don't think so it's user replaceable and uh, we have actually two dedicated slots uh, for our sim cards and also uh, so it will be interesting to see how it uh, functions uh, the Motorola dimple is still there as you can see but it's now pretty much recessed but still you can sort of feel it uh, so let me actually now try to power on this uh, device moving to the front facing camera it's actually a 5 megapixel shooter so let me quickly just boot this up and it says uh, Moto and by the time it actually boots up let me give you a configuration overview this Moto G4 Plus is powered by the Snapdragon 617 processor which is actually a octa-core processor clocked at 1.5 gigahertz it comes in two RAM models that is the 2 gigabyte or the 3 gigabyte RAM uh, models and uh, it is having a 5.5 inch 1080p HD screen with Gorilla Glass 3 production. Moving to the GPU, it has the Adreno 405 GPU clocked at 550 megahertz. Again, in terms of storage, it comes in two variants 16 gigabytes or 32 gigabytes. The one that we have has 32 gigabytes of storage, that means it'll have three gigabytes of RAM. It also has a dedicated micro SD card slot and it's a dual SIM device. Moving to the camera, it has a 16 megapixel rear facing camera with laser autofocus and also face detection autofocus. Hence, the focusing is supposed to be really fast. Moving to the front facing camera, it's a 5 megapixel shooter. It also has motor display, a fingerprint scanner, and it has a 3000 mAh battery and it supports fast charging. And by the way, guys, I was just setting up the Wi-Fi and the good thing is that it supports both the 2.4 gigahertz as well as the 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi band. And as it has a fingerprint scanner, uh, let's just set that up also now. Unlock it with fingerprint. Uh, so we'll just add one and uh, we'll just use a pin. One, two, three, four. Let's just put that for right now. One, two, three, four. And uh, we can set up our fingerprint scanner so we have to put our finger and so let's tap our finger a couple of times